Maisie from Crafty Twins, and I know I didn't get to do a video on Friday because we were really busy, and I'm really sorry about that. But once we get to the more weeks to come, we'll get more in the habit of doing them. But today I'm going to show you how to make some chalk paint, and it's really easy. And it's just a thing that me and Lally used to do when we were little, and I just found some chalk, and I found the supplies we need yesterday, and I just started doing it. So all you need is some water. Uh, you could use a bowl and a rock, but I have this. And I have some chalk and a paintbrush. And I'm going to make some blue paint. So I'm just going to be using blue chalk. Okay, so now I have this little tile, little trail that we have that leads to our pavement. So this is a perfect thing where I can just paint in and I'm going to do my, my making here because it can get a little messy. Okay, so I like blue and I'm just going to crush it with the chalk but first I'm just gonna add a little bit of water to soften it I'm just gonna take it I'm just gonna kind of crack it and I'm just gonna crack it a little bit till it gets a little bit more into smaller pieces see it gets a little messy okay so I've been crushing for like 20 seconds and that's how it looks like and I really like this color and usually I put in two pieces of chalk or this is like a leftover chalk from a while ago but don't use all your chalk on this because also you, you might later you might want to use actually some on the pavement or on anything. And so I'm just going to keep I'm doing that. And after this gets like smoothed out, I'm going to add my another piece. And it'll make even more. And it actually spreads out a lot. So it's pretty quick and I can just add some more water. And I'm just going to add this in and I'll just crush that up too. Okay, so I added kind of a lot of water. That's okay. And, like, there's never, never really how much water you need. Because you just use your instinct on how much you think will, you will need. Cause, and it's okay if you make it a little watery. Like, yesterday I did. And it still made it color. It's just, like, colored blue water. Or colored pink water. So, this is just kind of how it looks. And I'm just going to mash around for another minute or so. To make sure it's all smooth. Because I can still feel some chunks. But that's how it kind of looks when it's almost done. It's like the consistency of cream, and so now I'm just going to paint. So I have these different tiles, and when it, once it dries, it will get a lot more uh, solid, like as you can see on the paint. It was like that, and then it you it got a lot more, um, paint. Okay, yesterday it got a lot more thick and solid. And so I'm just going to keep painting, and this contains a lot, so and it's just a different way. And since I have tile things, I just like to paint them. Me and my sister usually do two different kinds, and then we just paint one and one different colors. Okay, and also like you can do little pictures, like a heart. If you want, you can do a peace sign. You can just simply color it in. And since there's different kinds of colors, and it will make it a lot more brighter, and I like that, but it will make it a lot more prettier. And you can use so many different kinds of chalk for all these different things. And make a peace sign. And so it's just really fun, and I don't know if any of you guys have heard of it, but meanwhile, I'm just like, let's crush some up. And then we put some water in it, and it made paint. So it's really cool if you want something else on your pavement. And when you crush it, it gets a little messy, but don't worry, it's washable. Like, cut all chalk is washable, especially on clothes. How do they clean it when they're done? And if you don't want anymore, you just spray it with the hose and see all these little designs they're really cute and it's so fun and see i've barely used any of it yet and see it can go a long way just a little bit and it's just really fun to make so i really hope you guys give this a try if you have chalk or if you don't go buy some because it's such a fun activity to do and i just i love this activity it's fun to do um on a spring day summer day whatever day you have where you can do this on open ground and so this is just a really fun activity that I want to share, share with you guys. So, and if you have any suggestions that you want me to do, be sure to leave it in the comments below. Thanks. Bye.